What's up everybody and welcome back. I'm Martavius. And I'm Carrie. And today we're going to take you guys behind the scenes of our Airbnb. We're so excited to show you. So stay tuned. Turn around Everybody say cheese. Three. Three. Alright, there we go. Today's episode is behind the scenes of the game room. We're going to walk you through the before and then we're going to show you the after. Now this is a room we actually did not see when we bought this house. It wasn't until we opened up the space and started putting the bathroom in that we saw how much extra space we had and we just decided to turn it into an extra experience that you can enjoy not only in the summer, but the winter and all night long, even if you wanna sleep and let the kids run. Uh, this is a perfect safe space that you can create lots of memories.
to keep the good vibes going. But before we go into the game room, this was actually just an exercise room. It wasn't finished. And because we started the process of the bathroom, we decided, you know what? We have this extra space. My husband said, let's turn this into a game room. I was skeptical, but I'm so glad we did it because now even I want to come here and play a ping pong match, babe. I think I'm going to win. But as you come into the game room, you are going to see the foosball table. We also have a 55 inch TV that you could watch the game on, play some music. Uh, back here, we have our little tiger friend because this is actually where our water shuts off so we don't want people standing on there. But I just thought this tiger was such a cool, it just makes it a whole vibe. Like take a picture with what we should call a milky or something. <laughs> Cookie. Our cookies, cookies the tiger. Okay. We also got this, uh, this was actually not in the vision when we first got this place. We had kind of talked about a game room, but it was never something that we were gonna do. But because it ended up being such a big space, we decided to put the ping pong table and you can get your ping pong balls and your paddles over here. We also have this super fun uh, ring toss with our milk and cookies, hope you're staying sweet sign. Then we put a place, a ledge that you can put your drinks on. You can sit up here, watch the game, listen to some music. Again, pulling in the black and white theme and the fun hand vibes. And wait till you see this part. Let's say you want to make it a real vibe. You turn the lights off and you can just hang out. The other thing, when we first bought this house, like I said, this whole space was completely open. This was their storage area with just a washer and dryer. None of this was framed. So we did a lot of framing, drywall, uh, lots of paint. The entire room was painted. The floor was painted. Uh, so what you're in, we actually painted the ceiling in here black as well to continue on with the black and white theme. This door was also not here. None of this was here. So we're going to show you now that we actually have a laundry area. This was extra space, so we just decided to turn it into a utility room and a storage area and just clean it up and make it look nice. That was before and after of our game room. This is definitely one of my favorite spots in the house and my kids love this area. I actually can't wait to do a competition with my husband on this ping pong because I'm gonna kick his butt. <laughs> but make sure you follow us on TikTok at the Milk and Cookies house. We hope you're staying sweet and I'm gonna set the mood.